Hello everyone, my name is Frank Apicella and today we're going to go over a fixed background in CSS. So uh, it's kind of a simple concept, but as you can see here, the background isn't moving, but everything on the page is. So it's kind of a cool effect and there's a lot you can do with it. One example that I've made before on another website is as you can see here, the background behind this text here is a fixed image and as I'm scrolling through the page, you can actually scroll through the image and it's kind of a cool effect. And there's a lot of other uh, things you can do with it. There's, I'm sure there's a lot of better examples of this, but uh, you know, it, it can be used in a very creative way. But it's really simple to do. So basically right here, this is it. Now this is kind of a shorthand uh, for background uh, styles. So if we wanted to separate this out, we can do background image is uh, URL and then put in that right and then we can do background attachment fixed right and background position center if I can spell right so all of this is in this one line here so this is the there is an order to this you have to put the image first and if you even wanted um, if if this background didn't cover the whole thing but just part of it you would put the color here or the color that you'd want to fill in the rest of it with um, then would be the image and then whether it's fixed or not basically the attachment part of it and then the position would be at the end but and there's a couple more values you can put in there but that's just a simple way of doing it or you can do it like this so that's really it for more information you can head over to snippetcentral.com where I have a short little blurb about it and actually only have the uh, background attachment uh, part because really that's all you need once you have a background you just add that and uh, and it'll keep it fixed for you so I hope you guys enjoyed and until next time